Morning, everybody. Got a big job on deck, about 130,000 square feet. So we're starting off with two days of milling, two days of paving. Probably have to use the mini miller around the loading dock, so it'll probably be easier to get the small machine in there, you know? This thing is nice. Brand new trailer. So this building has to be in full operation at all times. It's a 24-hour warehouse. While we were planning this whole job out, we wanted to make sure that the delivery schedule aligned around the work that was going on. If we pave them in first thing in the morning and then just work our way out. Take like three or four guys, mm -hmm. start doing like some shim course and stuff. While the rest of the cleanup and prep is going on. Yeah. Makes sense. Tagging yeah. first half Thursday, yeah. second half Friday. Yeah. That sounds like a plan. All right. All right, dude. We got so far ahead in terms of milling, we actually finished it yesterday. So on day two, basically, we're just doing a bunch of trimming and cleaning some edges. We got some piles that were left over. But now we're going to be putting down this leveling course. So there were so many inconsistencies in the binder. That leveling course is going to make sure that when we come in to pave tomorrow, what we're paving on top of is nice and smooth. Level finish, because we're all about quality and perfection, baby. <laughs> Drivers who haul asphalt, please stop doing this to us. We hate it. To drag it up and to make it echo and to get involved and to fall in love and to become attached. It's just like riding a bike. It's a balance. We Turn this corner, floor. finish that front little parking lot, and all the loading docks out. Perfect. Tomorrow should just be the far curb and the two drive lanes. Perfect. All right. You like it? Yeah, man. Love it. Got another 40 tons on deck, man. Going absolutely sicko mode today. The whole squad is dialed in. They really can't be defeated. Seamless, Seamless Pete, Pete on the mat. He's back on the job. I mean, the proof is in the pudding, right? Where are they? I think the customer paid extra for the seamless asphalt because we can't see him anywhere. Let's go. <laughs> On the final day of the project, I think that this is going to be a true testament as to why people should use Royal Pavement Solutions, um, especially in this type of environment, the industrial environment. Yeah. Yo, that sun's hot already today. It is. It's not even 8:30. We're out here cooking. Bum, 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 bum. Oh yes, so oh, yes. Last pass of the day. Over 100,000 square feet of pavement completed so far. Major success. Customer shows up yesterday and they're like, oh, we were waiting to give you the next PO until we see how you did on this one. Now they got like three or four more lined up for us. That's what we do. Full send, all gas, no brakes. This is what you get. Four long, grueling days. I just like to say, it's not even two o'clock yet and we're getting the hell out of here. So I'd say Friday went super smooth. We encountered a few challenges. We got around it and um, that's a wrap. Kenny Roy from Royal Pavement with Pete my Pappas. man, Pete Pappas, the parking lot paving professional. Peace. <laughs>